Ladies and gentlemen, children of the interwebs, it's Sebastian Envy, the strong style nerd, strong style cinephile. And Tommy is back in the next episode of Arrow. Let's geek about that for a few minutes here. Now we've seen in promotional photos from the CW that Tommy, Colin Donnell, Donald, is reprising his role as Tommy in the next episode. He's still sporting that wicked awesome beard that he had in Chicago Med. Wish I could grow one like that, but I can't. Such is life. Um, clearly he's going to be a hallucination. I'm betting, considering the circumstances, that Oliver's sister Emigo just buried, you know, Team Arrow under tons and tons of rubble and left them for dead, and that Oliver has tried to redeem his wayward sister, failed at that. She's curb stomped him every time they fought. Uh, so I think he's going to be feeling pretty down on himself. The fact that his father, once again, his father's misdeeds have come back to haunt him and haunt Star City. So I think it's going to be a situation where he's going to be feeling totally down on himself and ready to give up. And then Tommy Hallucination is going to come um, kick his butt into shape, tell him that you're a hero and you need to get up and keep fighting and blah, blah, blah. That's how I think it's going to go. It's cool that we was get Tommy back again. He was, last time we saw him, he was bailing out uh, Oliver when he was on trial, but of course that was the Tommy that was played by the human target, and Tommy really died back way, way back in the season finale of season one. Um, so it's cool that they got him back. Again, as I've said many, many times, I think as we head into the last 10 episodes of the season, we will get callbacks to uh, previous uh, episodes over the course of the, you know, seven years of Arrow. I think we'll get some more Thea, some more Malcolm. Um, Robert Mora, don't know about that. Maybe, considering Robert's misdeeds are, like I said, what created Emiko. So maybe we'll get something, uh, some more of him in the final ten, 10 episodes. Who knows? I'm curious to see how things will turn out. Like I said, I think he's going to be a motivational hallucination for Oliver to kick him into to high gear for the final showdown with Emiko, which, like I said, I'm hoping it's a f like fisticuffs and not just them yelling back and forth at each other and making you know making it all like emotional and all that kind of stuff. I just want to see him throw it out because the fights it, it, recently since Oliver goes around unmasked, which is stupid because I know that we know that everybody knows who he is, but still there's a mystique and a certain um, just coolness about him going with the hood on. Uh, we know he doesn't have to wear it, but also the hood helps switch out stuntmen and they can do the cool stuff that Stephen Amell can't do in fights. So I think since uh, the hoods come off, fights have kind of gone, like quality has kind of gone down because a lot of it's like Stephen himself. Um, that's just my two cents on that, kind of random, I know, went on a tangent. But anyway, Tommy's back. What do you guys think about that? You've heard some of my thoughts on it. More importantly, what do you guys out there think? Let me know, comment below. Um, follow me on social media as well. Talk to me there. Talk to me here. Talk to me everywhere. I mean, there's so much cool stuff going on. It's just geek.